hi guys hope you enjoyed the previous videos welcome to another online class and today we will be looking at nouns yeah but before we continue let's take a look at the lesson objectives for today at the end of this lesson the pupils should be able to one define nouns two list the types of nouns and um, finally give examples of nouns now let us go on into the topic proper now what are nouns we said nouns are parts of speech that deal with the name of a person animal place thing or idea so we said a noun is a naming word don't forget that a noun is what is a naming word it's that part of speech that deals with what naming of persons animals place places things or ideas now let us take a look at examples of nouns one person on that person we have smith we have john we have adewale we have samantha we have david okay don't forget that we said a noun is what is the name of a person animal place thing or idea so we've seen person let's look at other examples animals now for that animal we have dog cat whale leopard tiger then we have place london cameroon nigeria usa britain india then we have thing like your shoe your book your crayon your pen your television and so on and so forth then ideas when we talk of that we say birthday wedding anniversary a uh, wedding anniversary and so on and so forth all these are what are ideas so don't forget a noun is what is the name of a person and is, is the name of a person animal place thing or idea types of nouns there are different types of nouns namely we have common noun we said this type of noun refers to what people or things in general examples of such are boy girl country father sister birthday etc so this is another one proper nouns okay that is uh, it deals with the special name given to a person examples deborah Atant atantica india jerry and don't forget that we said proper nouns begin with capital letters also we have the third one which is the abstract nouns this is a, a noun for something that cannot be seen but you can feel it it refers to ideas conditions and what qualities examples you have your happiness you have sadness oh he's sad <laughs> sadness humor love hate time and truth okay still on types of nouns we have countable uh, we have the countable nouns we said this type of noun can be what counted okay it operates with an article this article is known as article is known as article a article an and what there so these are examples of countable nouns then we have the uncountable nouns the opposite the exact opposite of countable um, um, nouns uncountable nouns okay is the exact opposite of countable nouns and we said this type of noun cannot be counted example water you can't count water um, oil and so on and so forth so we have collective nouns this is a noun this noun is a word for group of things people or what or group of animals okay all right still on count um, types of nouns we have the concrete nouns okay as the name implies it refers to what do things we can physically see feel touch smell and taste okay it is the opposite of abstract nouns look at your examples laptop and so on and so forth then we have compound noun a compound noun contains two or more words that join together to make a single noun or words that are hyphenated examples toothpaste tooth um post office um um father-in-law and so on or brother-in-law and so on and so forth all right see you some other times guys please don't forget to click on the subscription button all right bye for now